The Academy of the Arts is a new art school opening in the western suburbs. It's hosting its first fundraising event tonight called A Night of Broadway. Joining us now with the details are Broadway actress Kathy Rigby and Sade Nichol. Thank you so much for being here, ladies. Well, we're so excited about being here and so excited for the Academy of the Arts, and I can't wait to hear you sing. <laughs> yes, that's <laughs> right. We do have, have a performance, performance coming, coming up. up. Yeah. But we should, you know, Chicago has so many wonderful things for the arts, but a lot of it doesn't make its way out into all the suburbs. So mm -hmm. Is that why you chose to put it in the suburbs? Well, I, I'm, I'm not the, the founder of this. Uh, a gentleman who was um, seven years old when he started thinking about this, our, our friend Dylan, um, is, has put, had this goal for years and years. And um, I run an Academy of the Arts in California, oh. and he asked me to come out and be Wonderful. part of it. And I have to tell you that I've never been in, you know, through Olympics, through my career in theater, never seen anything affect children so dramatically than the arts. And if you can add that with academics and excellent academics, and you can bring in all these professionals mm -hmm. to help, I, I'm very, I'm going to move to Chicago. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, really? yeah. I'm going to move here. Back. And these are some there of the kids that we were working with last yeah. night, and, and we gave them about two minutes to rehearse, but there is such a group that it's their aha moments of what they can do despite their level. Yeah. They find their unique, uh, you know, their unique potential, and it's just a thrill to well, work with them. They do say that math and music yep. are directly tied, so absolutely. I can see how that absolutely helps with their education. But also, kids are, I mean, they, they have to be confident. Yes. And, and you guys know this, too, that I, I don't know about you, but I was so shy, and had, had I not been introduced to the arts at 20, I don't know what would have happened. I used to cry when I gave oral book reports in school, so to be, oh. it, to be able to be in the arts after gymnastics, it yeah. was yeah. the best thing ever. Because you were on a stage all the time even before that, so it's interesting. Different stage, Different yes. Stage. Different stage, yes. Yes. Sade, did you grow up in an art school, or was this is this something new to you? Actually, you know, I grew up in Joliet, which sure. is a Chicagoland suburb, yes. and I did train in dance, um, but one thing that I'm so excited about, about the Academy of the Arts, is that it's going to offer all of the core traditional subjects that also meet the state standards sure. but it's going to be tied with fine arts and performing Ugh. arts uh, training as well mm -hmm. and also have access to the industry as it is in real time and mm -hmm. so that's something that I think is so so important mm -hmm. um, and I would have loved you know when I was Ugh. growing up yeah. you know because you get the village and you get the training but you also get the network yes. and the opportunities which is really really important I, I instantly think of fame and those yes. kids yeah it was sure. such a wonderful show yeah. but it, it, it's not necessarily reality for a lot of kids who aren't directly tied already to the arts yes. right and it needs to be mm -hmm. um, and and the, just the inclusivity and the crea creativity nowadays in the academic world they want people that have that creative background to be able to think out of the box yeah. you know because I have little ones I have a four-year-old and a two-year-old and if you just sit there and listen to their conversation oh, between the so two of them funny. it's amazing what happened yeah. and you you get older and you're like how did I lose that exactly. and I think mm -hmm. it gets out of beaten out of them mm -hmm. not literally beaten out but, of them but they get trained to tamp that down but see an art school can help that to flourish, I would have think. Their own individual personalities and, and, and you know, uh, whether or not they ever go on to Broadway or whatever, it will help them in every single thing that they do. Even improv. Yeah. Improv. You can improv, you can stand on stage, you can go to an interview, you can do anything. Um, I have one girl that got a, a scholarship to Northwestern uh, most recently. She went to our academy and always smart but shy as can be. Mm -hmm. Used to cry when she would have to sing. Went through uh, junior high, high school, started doing shows and then all of a sudden she's uh, valedictorian and, oh and this gosh. is not that she has the best voice but, but she she worked for it and she got a scholarship mm -hmm. that's amazing yeah. to a great school too yeah. by the way yeah. um, right. fundraiser is tonight so tonight you'll get the mention on the screen we don't want to take too much time up because we also going to listen to Sade perform in Yay. just a second so <laughs> right. ladies thank you so much for joining us we appreciate thank it you. we'll be back with you in a second uh -huh.